Hello, I'm Matt Guff from House.com, and I'm here with a Nick Jacobson from Oakley. Nick, how are you doing, buddy? I'm good, how are you? It is a good day. Uh, Nick is actually walking us through the 2018 Oakley helmets and goggles. This is the Airbrake XL, an extra large kind of goggle with some pretty cool frame designs. What's the story with this thing? So Airbrake was where we introduced switch lock for the first time in snow. And you can see that on this goggle. Um, if you look on the side here, you've got the switch lock. Yep. So you've got the quick release there. You put your finger right here. You pop that Boom. So, Fast. Yeah, you can change this on the chairlift with mittens on. It's pretty awesome to be able to have that adaptability, to uh, be able to change immediately to different conditions uh -huh. um, with no problem Damn. whatsoever. And it's just really that it's just really that fast. Now, yep. how many now how many pairs of lenses does the Airbrake XL come with? The Airbrake will come with two sets of lenses. Two sets of lenses. Yep. And what kind of lenses are those? Uh, they're gonna be Prism lenses. Prism lenses. Yep. What's uh, what's the story behind the Prism, and why so, would I need two? So the big thing with Prism is is it allows you to to see things that you were missing, right? So what we did with with Prism was we went out into the wild, we took a spectrometer, we measured the light rays in different environments, and made sure that we were amplifying the correct light in different environments. Sure. So, what we wanted to do is make sure that um, in a situation such as with the snow, you go out in the morning where it's sunny, mm -hmm. it's uh, brisk, and you've got you know no clouds in sight. You've got a lens that's going to help block out a ton of a ton of light. Um, and then maybe in the afternoon, the clouds are rolling after lunch. You need to be able to get down from the upper alpine. You're able to switch over to a lens such as this prism rose. It's going to allow it a little more light, still give you the definition and contrast that you need. Sure. But allow you a, a the unparalleled and un, you have the right tool for the job. Gosh. It's a, it's a really nice fit, too. Like, why, what makes these so comfortable, really? Um, the nice thing with the air brake, it's great. We've still got an outrigger system, so it's going to really help uh, dissipate pressure out of the frame itself. So you're not okay. going to be pulling the, the frame of the lens out of, out of, out of wax, so you're not going to distort the, uh, the optics at all. Yeah. Um, we've got a three-stage foam. Okay. So on the three-stage foam, it's, it allows you to make a great seal around your face. Sure. So it's going to adjust and, and contour to the different uh, contours of your face. And then we do a fleece backer on it to uh, make sure it's comfortable. Got it. Yep. Now, are these uh, are these over the glasses compatible? Uh, with with the way the switch lock is and the, and the chassis system, these ones are not OTG. Okay. Yep. Yeah. We have now to have a little more rigid chassis with the way the switch lock works, so that you can interchange it quickly. So. Yep. Sure. But it does have a wider port on the inside, so you know if you have a smaller set of prescription eyewear. Yeah. There is adaptability there if need be. Got it. Okay. Now this is the XL. Is there is there other sizes as well? There's not anymore. We're just okay. doing the XL version. Yep. So we had original the original Airbrake uh, was released years ago and. It kind of trained itself. It was a little bit smaller fit, so okay. we've got you know the XL version now. I kind of like you know the the new trend is like these bigger lenses mm -hmm. and bigger bigger goggles. But you you were mentioning uh, something earlier, not just bigger. What what's what was that story? So what we like to call is optimized fit, not oversized fit. So okay. you kind of feel as it sits on your face. The, the face plate is comfortable. Yeah. But yet as you look out, you do have that unrestricted peripheral view. Uh, up and down, side to side. Got it. Awesome. Now, how well do these work with helmets? They're going to work great. Yep. With that outrigger collection, that's going to really um, kind of allow it to stretch around the helmet. Or again, as it, 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 some people, as they wear their goggle straps underneath, it allows it so you're not bending it to, to get it around. We've got that silicone impregnated strap. We're yeah. just going to stick on and stay put. Where not going to slide. Yep. Yep. And what I really like, and this is across the entire line, is how low profile the backs are. Yep. If you want to wear it underneath your helmet, you can mm -hmm. you can do that. That makes Without it comfortable. Without like having, you can feel, you know. Yep. Oh man. Oh cool. Well, Nick, thanks for being here. Yeah. Cool. Good to have me. You're welcome, man. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys have ever ridden on or in uh, the air brakes or air brake XLs, make sure to leave a comment or a question below. Uh, thanks for watching and uh, subscribe to the channel. Right, right down there, maybe. Peace. Yeah. <laughs>